Hi friends, in this video we are going to uh, talk about internet access technologies. There are many different ways to connect users and organizations to the internet. Home users, businesses and small offices might require a connection to an internet service provider that is ISP to access the internet. And these connection options may vary between ISP or geographical location. And here we can see popular connection choices available uh, such as broadband cable, DSL, wireless vans, mobile services, etc. And now we will see uh, the different internet connections for uh, home and small office. Uh, we can see such as a DSL, cable, cellular, uh, satellite and dial-up telephone. We will see these connections uh, one by one. Coming to cable. Cable internet refers to the delivery of internet service over cable network. Typically offered by cable television service providers, the internet data signal is carried on the same cable that delivers cable television. It provides a high bandwidth, always on connection to the internet. Next is a DSL that is Digital Subscriber Alliance. It provides a high bandwidth, always on connection to the internet. Digital subscriber line is a communication medium which is used to transfer internet through copper wire telecommunication line. DSL runs over a telephone line. In general, small office and home office users connect using asymmetric DSL that is ADSL which means that the download speed is faster than the upload speed. Better, we will see uh, types of uh, DSL. Uh, here we can see uh, types of DSL, uh, symmetric DSL and asymmetric DSL. Coming to a symmetric DSL, that is a S DSL, uh, splits the upstream and downstream frequencies evenly, providing equal speeds to both uploading and downloading data transfer. Next is asymmetric DSL, that is A DSL provides a wider frequency range for downstream transfers uh, which offers several times faster downstream speeds. Coming to the next internet connection that is cellular. Cellular internet access uses a cell phone network to connect. Wherever you can get a cellular signal, you can get cellular internet access. Performance will be limited by the capabilities of the phone and the cell tower to which it is connected. Next is a satellite. A satellite internet connection is an arrangement in which the upstream that is outgoing data and the downstream that is incoming data are sent from and arrive at a computer through a satellite. The availability of satellite internet access is a real benefit in those areas that would otherwise have no internet connectivity at all. Satellite dishes require a clear line of sight to the satellite. Next is a dial-up telephone. Dial-up internet service is an inexpensive option service that allows connectivity to the internet through a standard telephone line. The low bandwidth provided by a dial-up modem connection is usually not sufficient for large data transfer, although it is useful for mobile access while traveling. Now we will see different internet connections uh, used in business. Usually they use uh, dedicated list lines, metro ethernet, DSL or satellite. Here are many connections already we have seen. Uh, so coming to the first one that is a dedicated list line. Uh, list lines are actually reserved circuits uh, within the service providers network that connect geographically separated offices for private voice and data networking. The circuits are typically rented at a monthly or yearly rate. They can be expensive. Next is Ethernet VAN. Ethernet VANs extend LAN access technology into the VAN. Ethernet is a LAN technology. The benefits of Ethernet are now being extended into the VAN. Here again DSL in business. So business DSL is available in various formats. A popular choice is a symmetric digital subscriber lines, that is SDSL, which is similar to the consumer version of DSL, but provides uploads and downloads at the same speeds. 
Next is again satellite. Uh, similar to small office and home office users, satellite service can provide a connection when a wired solution is not available. Right. In this video, we have seen a different internet access technologies. Friends, if you have any doubt, any suggestions, please comment below. Consider subscribing for the future videos. And we will meet again with the next video. Thank you.